Hello, Frugal Force. Once again, this is Captain Frugal away on location, and I'm talking about how poor the Marvel Comics sales are and how they're currently getting spanked by DC. I'm using June, uh, tw June 27th comic book sales to comic shops from Comicron for this. Now, just so you know, this does not include digital sales or direct to home, but this also we have to consider is not books really sold to the general people this is only sold to the stores as well as given to the stores or forced on the stores and over inflating sales so looking at this this is really telling peter parker spectacular spider-man number one the first issue sold really well good but let's see how that pans out after issue three or heck even issue two and see if there's a 50 percent fall off and then really see more by issue five then look, Dark Days by the Ford, that's DC, Star Wars, Darth Vader, it's Marvel, Batman, DC, Dark Knight 3, DC, Batman, Edge of Venomverse, Secret Empire, Walking Dead. The kicker here is, and this is really noticeable how bad uh, Marvel is doing. For one, the writers like Dan Slott sit there and say, oh, well, you get the dollar volume. The dollar volume doesn't matter. They're counting ship books to them, not actual sold, as well as most of their books have a higher price point than DC books. So DC is actually saying higher numbers. Now look at this. Here's something that's very telling. Marvel is not even cracking the top 10 without having it be a number one issue, okay, or Star Wars book, or a big event. So it has to be Star Wars, big event or a number one issue otherwise they can't even crack the top 10 their flagship character amazing spider-man issue 29 only sold 59,464 copies that's their flagship character we should be comparing it to batman and look at here 116,037 or issue 25 of batman 102,798 they are getting killed so marvel should be buying stock in ky at this point because they are getting raped by dc I mean, their books are selling like a wet turd going down the toilet. As DC continues to grow and grow and pick up sales with be being smart about core characters, Marvel keeps pandering and lying with Legacy and losing trust of the readers. And evidently, Legacy has been a big failure to them in the people's eyes. They're not getting what they expected. So, I mean, really, look, Marvel can barely even hit the top 20 now, granted, if we took some of those Star Wars books out and stuff, sure. But books like Amazing Spider-Man, Old Man Logan, these are flagship characters. Wolverine and Spider-Man should be selling much higher than the 50s. And then we continue to look. We barely hit any. It's just DC is wiping them out. You know, they continue to brag about books like Miss Marvel and things like that. But really, really, Miss Marvel, her sales are atrocious. Here's Black Panther, by the way. Terrible. Okay, the sales have just been absolutely atrocious for Marvel, yet they keep trying to brag and push characters. Here's Miss Marvel number 19, by the way, 17,907. Try telling me that's good numbers. Luke Cage, number two, 17,000. And these are, some of these are good characters. They just need good writing and good stories. Get off the, the politics and the SJW crap. Get focused and get your numbers right. This is ridiculous. Marvel, your sales are tanking and you deserve it. I want to see Marvel do better. What do you guys think? What are your thoughts on this? Do you think that they really need to step it up? Do you think DC is killing them? Do you think Marvel has a chance of coming back? Or is it too little, too late? Let me know what you think in the comments section. And please be sure to hit like and subscribe and join the Frugal Force. Hit that bell so you get notifications of my videos. A lot of my, my uh, subscribers tell me they're not getting notifications regularly. And if you really want to help, check me out on VidMe. And if you want to support me a little bit, I don't have a Patreon set up yet. You can do a one-time support with a tip. Or you can even subscribe for as little as a dollar just to help me out. So until next time, frugal fans, keep it frugal.